Heaven knows I wait. Just to feel another breeze. To lie beneath another sun. Good morning, world! I hope everybody is doing fine this morning, wherever you are in this world. I hope everything is wonderful at your end. About us here, it's cold. It's brutal cold. We are in a deep freeze right now because we are in a deep freeze. It's for two weeks now, and there's still a lot of uh, snowstorms in the forecast. Today, I am going to take you to Mount Samat in the Philippines. Mount Samat is a national shrine, or it's it's called the Shrine of Valor. In the Philippines, it's called the Bana ng Kagitingan. It is located near the summit of Mount Samat in Pilar, Bataan in the Philippines. It is a historical memorial shrine complex built to honor and remember the gallantry of the Filipinos and American soldiers known at that time during the World War II as the USAFE or the United States Armed Forces of the Far East who fought during World War II. Mount Samad Shrine consists consist of a colonnade and a white memorial cross that stands as a remembrance to the soldiers who fought and lost their lives in the Battle of Bataan, also widely known as the Bataan Death March. The shrine was conceived as a fitting memorial to the heroic struggle and sacrifices of the soldiers who fought and died in that historic bastion of freedom. The Mount Samat Shrine Complex also includes a war museum with a wide array of collections from paintings of the Philippine heroes to armaments used by the Filipinos and Americans and Japanese armed forces during the battle or during the World War II war or battle. <laughs> Okay, the colonnade and the cross, it offers the panoramic view of the Corregidor Island and on a clear day is the city of Manila across Manila Bay. Along with the fortified island of Corregidor, Mount Samat was the site of the most vicious battle against the Japanese Imperial Army in 1942 or during the World War II and it's called the Battle of Bataan. The Yosafe or the United States Armed Forces of the Far East suffered heavy losses against the Japanese all over Luzon or all over the Philippines so the Filipinos and American soldiers retreated to Bataan Peninsula to regroup for a last valid but futile stand. This retreat to Bataan is part of the United States strategy as uh, known as a war plan orange. This war plan orange, their last, the, the American armed forces of the Far East, 
because all over the world is at war during that time. So of course, um, in the Philippines, the USAPE or the armed forces, um, the U the United States Armed Forces of the Far East is also only in uh, only Filipinos and American soldiers. So this war plan orange was supposed their their uh, supposed to be their last effort to uh, regroup. But then it still fell. After three days, the Bataan still fell to the Japanese Imperial Army. And so, 78,000 exhausted and sick and starving men under Major General Edward P. King surrendered to the Japanese Imperial Army on April 9, 1942. It is the only time in history that the U.S. soldiers surrender to the enemies. Together with the Philippine soldiers, they were then led on to what is known now as the Bataan Death March. The Bataan Death March in Filipino is known as the Marcha ng Kamata Marcha ng Kamatayan sa Bataan was the forcible transfer by the by the Imperial Japanese Army of approximately 75,000 Filipinos and American soldiers or troops of prisoners of war on Bataan where they were forced to make an arduous 70 miles or 112 kilometer march from Bataan and Tarlac to Pampanga to Pampanga uh, to Pampanga um, Prison, prisons. The marchers made a trick in intense heat. You know, in the Philippines, it's um like um it's very humid and very hot. So Heaven knows I wait Just to feel another breeze To lie beneath another sun In Germany here I Big hearts are filling up the hemisphere. Big hearts are warming up the coldest years. They lie beside me forevermore. Big hearts make
Big hearts are filling up the hemisphere. Big hearts are warming up the coldest years. They lie beside me forever. Hearts make mine grow. Big hearts are full in northern lights. They come full circle, they defy signs. Big hearts of freight trains push me along. Shine out the clear shine, shine on. Big hearts of factories, godlike beams. They just get brighter as the daylight. Heaven knows I wait Just to feel another breeze To lie beneath another sun In Germany here I Big hearts are filling up the hemisphere. Big hearts are warming up the coldest years. They lie beside me forevermore. Big hearts make Softly rest the mile. 